themselves. Thank you. IBAW! We are at war, and we are in a war that is about oil. It's not only about oil, it's not the only thing that's happening, but it certainly has a very strong oil component. That's the bad news. The good news is we've been in a similar position before and we have found a way out and we can do it again. The even better news is that we know, we know, that there is a non-war diplomatic solution. Islamic State is fighting a very sophisticated oil war. It took over the oil fields of Total and Shell in Syria. It controls 60% of Syria's oil with all of that money. It's buying fighters. It moved into Iraq. It took over oil fields. And when it threatened the fields of Exxon and Chevron and Shell is when the United States started bombing. We attacked to protect oil resources, and we, we attacked to protect oil companies. Islamic State is a horror and needs to be stopped, but more bombing in protection of oil is what led us into this position in the first place. The fact that Islamic State is fighting an oil war means it can also be stopped. You can cut off their black market for oil. You can have a diplomatic solution to cut off their support. And what we don't want to do is, as we did in 2003, launch a war that ended up with a country that was closed to foreign oil companies is now the home of Exxon, Chevron, BP, Shell. That not only makes us upset, that makes the people that live there upset. That not only makes us angry, that makes them angry. But again, there are solutions. What makes Exxon stronger makes us weaker in trying to protect the planet. Everything that we do to try and protect the planet makes Exxon weaker. The weaker Exxon is, guess what, the less power it has. The less power it has, the more we can do things like ensure that three-fourths of the world's remaining fossil fuels stay in the ground. When we weaken the oil industry, we weaken its political power, we weaken its ability to make us do extreme things like fight wars and die and kill and suffer on its behalf. And we make it more possible for us to do all of the incredible alternatives that we know how to put in place, like the windmills, like the solar panels, like all the signs I'm seeing. We know, we know who is responsible. We've stopped them before. We have the solutions, and we can implement them. Thank you for being here. Woo!